a Russian journalist reportedly shot and killed this week appeared alive and well at a news conference today. It was all part of a plot to find the people making threats to his life. CBS 4's Tina Kraus has more on this real life back from the dead drama. It's the stuff of soap operas. The press gasped and applauded when a supposedly murdered Russian journalist appeared in the flesh during a news conference about his own death. I would like to apologize to my wife for the hell she has been through in these last two days. Olichka, I'm sorry, but there were no other options. 41-year-old Arkady Babchenko apologized to his family and to those who thought he was dead. The dissident journalist said the real story is he'd been part of a police action to foil an actual attempt on his life. Babchenko, a vocal critic of the Kremlin, said Ukrainian security services coordinated the special operation. The fake story played out with Babchenko's wife discovering her husband bleeding from gunshot wounds outside their apartment building in Kiev. Babchenko supposedly died in the ambulance on the way to the hospital. Ukrainian authorities say they've detained one of their citizens who was allegedly paid $40,000 by the Russians to get rid of Babchenko. Yeah! Babchenko's colleagues in Kiev cheered and danced around their office when they learned he was alive. But the group Journalists Without Borders released a statement saying, while the reappearance of the reporter may be a great relief, it is deeply regrettable that Ukraine's authorities have played with the truth no matter their motive. Russia's foreign ministry said it was pleased Babchenko is alive and called his fake murder anti-Russian provocation. Tina Kraus, CBS News.